Hey folks, Harley Day right here, back at you once again, your good old friend HDR, coming out of the traffic of Washington, Pennsylvania, stop and go, stop and go traffic, hey, bud. and uh, taking a ride out here to the Washington County Park, uh, I'm going to take a few more pictures uh, right now of the motorcycle, you see some pictures on the other videos I have, that I uh, snapped, I think I played through some in there for you. If you'd like to see more of those videos, if you if you like my Facebook page, my Facebook page is just Harley Day Rider. Um, I'll I'm going to post all the pictures on there, so everything will be on Harley Day Rider on Facebook. So, oh, never go that way, Jack. It's always this way. <laughs> oh, well, that was nice. Just made that guy crap his pants. <laughs> okay. So yeah, we're heading here into Washington County Park. And uh, there's a log, used to be a log cabin out here anyway. I don't know if it's still there or not. But we'll take it right up there and see if it's there. I'd actually like to take the back road into it, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to. Uh, I don't think that's it. I haven't been on these back roads for so long, I don't know what kind of shape they're in. And uh, that could be a, a little bit of a problem, getting a motorcycle in there. i got to take a look up here and see what it looks like. Because um, I think this one will do it. Yeah, Log Cabin Road. We can go for it. And we'll see what it looks like as we get down there. Oh. I think at least it's, uh, at least it's black-topped. We used to come out here a lot when we had the the kids were playing softball and baseball. We'd come out here and uh, the baseball and softball fields are up on a hill. But there's a great place up here, a log cabin, and I wanted to get some uh, shots of the bike. And it's uh, still a beautiful day out, so I got plenty of time. Nothing but time, so I figure I'm going to come out here and take some more. Somebody told me motorcycle porno pictures. Little gravel and stuff on these roads right here. Uh, let's see how it goes. I see there's gravel roads going into these baseball and softball fields here. But uh, we are not going that way. Let's sit up here so I can get a better view. Yeah. They're kind of they're, they're kind of blacktop. I mean, they're black, they're paved. But they haven't been worked on for several years, it looks like. There's a lot of holes and stuff in here. Like, here's a whole bunch of gravel right there. Does gravel freak you out as much as... Some people really freaks out. And some people's like, oh, it's all right. I mean, I told you guys, when we were on Wyoming, I don't know if I had any of that video or not, if I ever showed it, but... We were coming out of Wyoming going to uh, the Devil's Tower. And, uh... Unbelievably enough. <laughs> they had the road graded, and there was just no road. Yeah, let's see if you go up there, twist, that's the twist softball fields up on a hill. But there was no road, and, you know, I was really new to riding on gravel and dirt roads. I was like, it was, you have a pucker factor, you know, your butt's all puckered up. And uh, Mrs. HDR just held on, and she said, just keep going steady, slow and steady, slow and steady. And we just kept doing that the whole way, and we, you know, and we made it. We did a really good job on it, but it was at least five miles of nothing but just just dirt you know, on a touring bike it's you know it's kind of kind of eerie but sometimes you got to do that all right so we're coming up here to the low cabin right here on the right and uh we're gonna park the bike in the shade i think and try to get some pictures another big pothole I mainly want to get the log cabin in the back. I'm not going to be in the shade either because I don't want to be behind that tree. There we go. The first bike I ever brought out here for pictures was my, was my uh, Sportster. So, how about them apples, huh? There's somebody right there, too. There's got to be somebody when you're out doing something. With this dog. Of course he has his dog. Uh, oh, she does. She has two dogs. Well, that's nice. Nothing like getting eaten up by two different dogs. <laughs> so I think what I'll do...
bit of a crazy woman there. <laughs> what I think I'll do is I'll just keep filming with you guys, grab the camera, grab a couple quick pictures, and uh, we'll be out of here. I did want to set the tripod up, but that's not going to work because, like I said, there's people here. She's probably, and I hope she don't live in an apartment with her dogs. And if you do, I'm sorry, but dogs need to have some yard. That's for sure. So, this is my 35mm I use. This is a Sony A6000. A mirrorless DSL, DSLR. See, and then they crap in the park and nobody cleans it up. That's the bad side of things there. Let's get the log cabin behind her. Oh, yeah. She's looking lean and mean there. <laughs> Try to get it this way. Yeah, we get a few pictures over there anyway, but I wanted to get some more there. But try to get a low one here. I need to buy a new wide angle lens. I think the dog is coming this way. Nope, nope, she put him in the car. Good for her. Alright, so that's all I wanted was a few pictures. And, uh, oh no, now they're up here. Of course they are. So I start to bike them, then they'll just eat me. Of course, maybe they don't even know I'm here. Alright, let's turn that off. Yep, so you'll see these pictures on this video. And uh, how they look there. Alright. Other than that, I could go home and mow the grass. That's kind of important too. Before we get the storms coming in. All right. New antennas are getting bent. What do you think about that shorty antenna, huh? At the Harley dealer, thirty bucks. So it's not a hundred. It's only thirty. All right, doggies are down there. That gives me time to get out of here. All right, guys, let's move up here. Ooh. All right, so we are off. Well, thanks for joining me there to take some uh, log cabin motorcycle pics with the A6000, Sony A6000 mirrorless DSLR. That camera's traveled all over the place with me already. Um, I've also done some senior pics with it and I've done one, actually I've done one wedding with it, so. Wow, I should really look up the video from before. Look at this crazy place, huh? Whoo, they got that dug out. I don't know what they're putting up here. I don't know. All right, everybody, thanks for watching. I'm going to mosey here out of the Washington uh, Park, uh, which if you want to look on the map, you'll find it coming out of Washington, PA. It's on Route 440. Thanks for riding along with me there. Put some comments below. If, if you take a lot of pictures of your bikes, I'd like to hear from you. And uh, like I said, these, these pictures I said earlier will be on the Facebook page at Harley Day Rider. Go over and like that page. And uh, you will see things like photography, photographs on there, places we eat, uh, signs for places we eat and stuff like that. Anything we snapshot when we're out, you're going to see stuff on there about that. So that's pretty cool. Outside of the whole video thing. So, Alright, remember, ride your own ride. Be safe out there. We'll talk to you next time. Harley Day Rider is going to be up and out. <laughs> up and out. Here in the lovely 80 degrees of southwestern Pennsylvania. Bye bye for now, everybody. I showed that to you before. That is the Pony League World Series. The World Series, not just Washington, PA. 
the home of the Pony Lake. They play the World Series there every year. That's pretty exciting. There's people here from every part of the world. Tokyo, China, uh, wherever. Korea. There was Koreans here. All right. We'll see ya.